Hi guys. Good God, I have been standing up for seven hours here at the biggest party on the planet. The South by Southwest Music Festival here on this soon to be stormy Thursday night in South Austin, Texas. Good God Almighty, I have to take one more roll down uh, South Congress. I was going to be walking this, but uh, I need some damn back support. Your old man needs some back support. So, good God, what a day. I tell you. <laughs> oh, it is uh, Thursday, March 16th, 2023. As uh, we negotiate Negotiate Party Central down South Congress Avenue. Good Lord, how many times have I taken this stroll? But, uh, oh man, I, I'm just, <laughs> I'm just not built for it anymore, you guys. It's just the, uh, the sexual tension in this town. It's just, there is nowhere like South Austin, Texas. Good Lord, sitting there talking to all my old girlfriends. You know, I'm sitting there, you know, talking to my girlfriends, looking at who are these old fat women. There's the Continental Club. South by Southwest Continental Club. Let's see what the scene is back here. You know, it's, I mean, I love these. I love th these women dearly. But you know, I'm I'm looking at them. I mean, including you know these these women that I've slept with, and I'm just looking like, who are these old fat women? Uh, <laughs> You know, it's like I, I I vaguely recall I vaguely recall these girls. Well, now these sixty-something-year-old women, but good God! And so I was getting all depressed looking at, at, at how all of my friends, and this is my male friends too, of course, uh, how they've all gotten fat. And then I started looking around, you know, at the damn. You know that was depressing enough. All of the, uh, all of my 65-year-old friends have gotten fat. Then I'm, you know, then I'm looking around there, and I'm noticing that uh, all these 25-year-olds. Uh, it's just like, good fucking god, what has happened to Austin? The Austin used to always make the top 10 fittest cities. In the U.S., Austin would be in the top 10 fittest, and uh, Houston would be in the top 10 fattest uh, towns. And, and I'm looking at, you know, these 25-year-old these women. You know, these down in Bacalar, Mexico, they would have been, the, you know, these little hottie, uh, you know, vulva smoothie slurpers. And uh, I'm like, what the fuck has happened to Austin, Texas? So, I mean, it's like the, the fat 25-year-olds were uh, more depressing than the fat 65-year-olds. So uh, I, I guess the word is fluffy. I was told it's no longer, the word is not fat. The word is fluffy, that uh, women are getting fluffier. So... Uh, I said, well, at least, the, you know, these fluffy women, at least they tend to have big tits. So it was so crowded. So what I did is I took up, you know, I kind of stood right in front of the, uh, <clears throat> right in front of the women's restroom in this, in this shoulder to shoulder crowded room at Sea Boys. So, uh, you know, for the women to get to the restroom, they had to squeeze by me. So it, so at least just all day long, I was, uh, 
I was getting tits mashed into my shoulder blades. Yeah, so this, this is what it's come to. This is uh, this is Hambone at South by in uh, Austin, Texas, is hanging out in front of the women's restroom. So women have to press their tits into his back, uh, trying to go to the damn bathroom. Oh God. <laughs> That is that is what I have devolved to. So there's this one woman there who I uh, obviously will remain nameless. You know, it's this woman that I, I've been checking. I've been checking this woman out for like you know 25 years, and it's just a, it's there's just never been an opportunity. So she comes up to me, and she comes up to me. She gives me this big hug, and we're talking and she says you know she she knows that i'm staying like over an hour south of austin and she goes she goes well how much if you decide uh if you decide you don't want to make that drive she goes you know my place is just two blocks from here you can stay at my place and i'm thinking Oh Jesus! Uh, you know, 25 years, and so I, she sees the the wheels turning in my brain, and she goes, she goes, I'm not going to be there, uh, so it's available to you because because uh, <laughs> she's not going to be there. Oh God! And then this other woman who uh, I, I've been hearing about, uh, we'll call her. Uh, We'll call her Lulu. Uh, this crazy woman. So she's there with this uh, buddy of mine. And this chick is there with this buddy of mine, and he entered. We're we're out there in, in one of these outdoor uh, concerts, uh, and he introduces me, and she goes, "Oh, she goes." Your ham bone? She goes, I've been hearing about you for years. And I'm thinking, oh my God. And then she just starts, I mean, she gives me this big fucking hug. And it's like she's damn humping my damn leg. I mean, she was cute. Uh, she, she is not one of these 60-year-old women who has gotten fat and she, and she puts her... Uh, mouth right up to my ear and she goes she goes I'm not his girlfriend don't think that I'm his girlfriend and I'm thinking oh my fucking god and uh he's just looking over at me my buddy's just looking over at me and smiling oh, the fucking sexual tension of South Austin, Texas. Good God, I will be back for another day of it. There's a big, uh, some big ass thunderstorm rolling in, so I've got to go to Harry Butts and uh, get a few groceries and go back and see my dog. Oh God, this town. <laughs> oh. Get out there and enjoy your unresolved sexual tension while you still can. Bye guys.